So lesson one of Darksiders Genesis, don't backtrack. If you're wondering why I'm here again, it's because I used a wormhole to just kind of... I just wanted to get to a trickster door since I bought the trickster key necessary to get through said trickster door. And now I'm doing the whole first area again and I knew it too when I saw the map. I was like, ah, shit, seriously, you're gonna make me do that? And I was hoping that I was wrong, but I wasn't, so... onto the outer wall. More climbing. Ever consider wearing some lighter gear? No, what the fuck? Dude, I just want to get through the fucking area I've been, I got through already. All right, that's all I want to do. Upwards. Thank you. collected these already. I'm supposed to be regenerating, aren't I? Do I have to equip that or something? Oh, let's see. That's what that is. Alright, this is way too much reading. I don't know what's going on. I thought I had Earth Splitter. There it is. So I have to hold that down for a while.
How do I have that many minor cores? Please don't tell me I have to fight that. I, I really don't want to fight that guy again. I have to fucking fight him again? Are you fucking serious? Why in the hell? A hollow fiend! Get back! Damn, this guy is big. Who could command such a thing? Not Moloch, that's for sure. I have to fight this thing again. progress just does not Zip. it's just completely and utterly like ignored like I love that I also love when I have enemies I can't dodge. We'll not be slowed by this simple creature. Motherfucker. more of those we've delayed long enough we must reach Samael soon I had to fight the bu I mean this is ridiculous I just wanted to go get through it. oh god I know this was a joke why did I have to go back in time I'm not trying to shoot him back in time. At least I got my healing potion back. I should be able to avoid death consistently. A door that potentials can only sneak. Wait. All right, here we go. Come on. Can I skip all this? Perhaps. So I'm back here now. That was a tremendous waste of my time. Waste of our time. If I may say. Well, I mean, I have to showcase the game for all of you to see whether or not you want it. But I was never warned. I saw a review. It got a 6.5 from Game Informer, which yeah, their opinions are not really critiques. And on top of that, they think Persona 5 is the greatest game ever made, and they gave Darksiders 3 an 8, which Darksiders 3 was an embarrassment. Sent us here for a reason. We must discover why. Hmm. Do I have to talk to Vulgrim again, or can I just...
do my thing. Because really this was specifically so I can get through that trickster door. What the fuck, man? You know, I cannot stand platforming in general. Especially when you can't really get a good concept of perception. Dude, I have it! Okay, so why can't I just open this fucking door? This is why we're here. You knew we'd need it. Yeah? And just what is it? Allow me to demonstrate. If you're done showing off, Samael's associate awaits. <laughs> you almost sound jealous. Please. I had to go through the action of getting it done. What is this, a game from the 80s? Come on, man, seriously? Where's the trickster door? I went through all this for that specific purpose. Ugh. That's your but Come on, come on, we know what happens here. Yeah, I did that. Why are you acting like I didn't do this yet? I know, it was completed already. Why are you acting like it wasn't? My good, I just wanted to go back to the serpent hole that would have taken me back. And I had to go through the entire first area again as if it never happened. Anyway, video game critiquing like this. Gameplay mechanics. This is, for what I can detail to you, legit video game critiquing. What's most important is graph. Well, graphics and gameplay mechanics, obviously, because if it looks like shit, then most likely you're not gonna want to play it. We we eat and entertain ourselves with our eyes first, so the game's gotta at least look good. Another thing is it's pretty much gameplay mechanics, controls, obviously. Okay, so this is what I wanted to get through. Oh, wait, this is not what I wanted to get through. And then storyline has something to do. I mean, if you have a, a nice conscientious storyline that has some relevance to it. What's this? That's good, you don't want it to be complete idiocy. Where's the door, man? I want... But at the same time, to me, if a game has bad mechanics or a bad combat system or something, then I really don't care about the actual... What happened to the door? I don't really care about the actual... We have to talk to him again. Souls? No, we don't. All right. Both, I hope. Actually, hold on. Here you'll be having some fun. My store is your home. Please make yourself welcome. 
Alright, so I have the... Okay. Kill plenty. So we don't have to... Go through that again, but... So what the hell? Yes, do that. What happened to the door? I went through all that for a door I can't find anymore? So anyway, so like if the game sucks, like if it plays horribly, if the combat system's slow, the mechanics are not responsive, stuff like that, then I really don't care about the storyline. Now, if the storyline is stupid and all the other things of the above are just as bad, then the game sucks. Period. When I get Persona 5 Royal, I don't know why I said that like I was drunk. If I get Persona 5, no, when I get Persona 5 Royal for the Switch, you're going to see a bad video game. That's just the way it is. You're going to see a game whose mechanics are slow. The combat system is basically Pokemon. Cages. Yep, we're definitely in a dungeon. Let us find Vulgrim's troubling demon and pry the artifact from its dead hands. Oh, okay, now you're getting me excited. All right, new area. Fuck the doors. I'm not doing that. Unless they're on the way, I don't want to have anything to do with tricks and doors. What's this? And I am not backtracking. That is not happening. Can you do anything with that? Backtracking is dead to me. Oh. Gotta have these bombs. I like how they don't explode in your hand. Alright, this is this is bad. I thought it was strife. Did I switch to strife? Ah, cool. Well, there's a trickster door. So anyway. So yeah, you're talking about a game where your mechanics are basically walking around talking to people, listening to them speak because your character doesn't speak much, and then on top of that, having to go through high school. I know what people would say, well, what about Fire Emblem? Yeah, the Fire Emblem Three Houses, the whole school concept. Ooh, beam shot. Could just try it out. Equipped with beam shot, am I not? It is a big deal when you get a boatman. That doesn't look like beam shot. Combat system of Persona 5, by the way, is Pokemon. It's what it is. It's Pokemon. <laughs> Just you can negotiate. You'll see. If you've never seen a Persona 5 <coughs> Let's Play or Walkthrough, when I get the Royal version, you'll see how it's a Royal piece of shit. But again, it's like a. It's a so-called gamer's wet dream because it takes place in Japan and anything that's Japanese is a... A so-called gamer's wet dream.
Oops, I don't read these things. I keep pressing A and then they just skip through it. Like, I get the whole geek culture or whatever, but the obsession with Japanese, and I love Japanese women and I love the culture in the sense that women are still women, but that's just a personal issue because women aren't women here in the United States. But whatever the, well, not where I live anyway. Whatever the case, and the fact that they have cartoons with women in their undergarments and huh? they're pure and they're innocent, but they got huge tits and want to hump the first man they see, you know, stuff like that. Well, the first man that they feel is a decent guy. All right, so we're done here. That's not bad. Again, it's a loot drop. It's the Diablo. Darksiders Diablo. Now, here's another thing. I'm going to have to stop soon, and I'm wondering where they're going to start me off for the next playthrough. Or the next part. I am not going back in time. It's not going to happen. Alright, well, as long as everything didn't resurrect itself, I think I'm okay. Nothing there, right? Okay, let's keep moving. I'd love to be able to aim better. I know, I know, I know, it hurts. Did that miss? Now that I know how to use that, I'm using that often, baby. What's this? It's a means to an end. Come on, move. Trickster key. Trickster keys look like they open doors that are more or less just loot drops, which is fine. As much as I enjoy the Dark Souls games, and I do, when other companies try to copy them, they're just crap. And I'm talking Dark Souls, Demon Souls, the From Software games. Never played Demon Souls, never played Sekiro. I am not going to unless it's released on the Switch, which I don't think it will be, because they can't even release... Dark, Dark Souls 2, which, by the way, was a previous generation game. Ow. Holy shitbags, are you kidding me? Fuck is this guy? Ah, oh, you can stop doing that. Oh yeah, baby. I'm wondering, I mean, I've heard a rumor. I heard a rumor. No, no horses. That... Mass Effect's trilogy would actually be coming out on the Switch, but like in a hundred years. Think you can hit that crystal from here? Is that a serious question? By the way, the guy voicing over War is the same guy that's been voicing him over since the first one. Now... He, War, only appeared in Chew. Like, really appeared, you know, like, talked and everything. You know, if Lucifer is as dangerous as a council says he is, why'd they send just the two of us? Death and fury attend to other matters. It is not our place to question the will of the council. It's not my place to question your wardrobe, but I still think your armor could use some more creepy faces on it. Must everything be a joke to you? The council. You really need to lighten up. The council this and the council that. You want to hear an actual joke? No. Knock, knock. <sighs> <clears throat> You're supposed to say, who's there? Why would I give away my location? 
I would simply smash through the door and face my assailant. Uh, you're hopeless. That's pretty much war. Let's see what we got going on here. Look! Under the grate! Think that's Volgrim's artifact? These glyphs indicate some kind of locking mechanism. It seems our mission is more difficult than we thought. When is it ever easy? Come here, you. Nice. I didn't know I could do that until I did it. Okay, so... Oh, shit. Alright, anyway. Side quest. Do I have any other side quests that... No, right? You tell me that they were complete. If it's Darksiders, you have to do at least two of something. Most likely three. Darksiders 2 was, I always said it was actually comical as to how many things you had to do three of. I actually wanted to switch, actually. Oh shit, that's serious. Judgment! Stop puking. Because it's detrimental to my case, overruled. Good call! Very unpleasant things in... Hell. No, don't fucking do that! You're taking health away for doing things I don't want you to do, man. Up, 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 dick, dick up, dick. And he basically said, I'm looking up, dick. Boom! I'll give you some boom, motherfucker! To battle your ass. Ow, you fucking bastard. You are one, but we are many. No, that is true. He does have the point. Oh, shit. Alright, why can I not fucking defeat these guys? Get out of here! Dude, who is this? Why the fuck is he causing me so much fucking trouble? I'll take your head! You got close. Can I get something more defensive than that? Just a block and a fucking strafe, that's it? Alright, is there a check? Am I seeing a save somewhere? Where's the save icon? This auto saves every now and then. So I'm assuming that one over there is open. Ah, fuck you. Damn it. Did that count? No, I didn't. Slag flea. What do I just get a bunch of these? I want is this saving at all? Why is this thing just standing there? Destroy it all! No 
Honestly, the game's kind of buggy. And it had a big update, too. It's only gonna... Well, it wasn't a big update. It was like a, a second. It was an update, nonetheless. So, wait, what am I doing? a lot of souls. Looks like someone was saving up. What does it matter? Our goal is the artifact, not acquiring souls. Fulgrim's got a thing for souls and he has all kind of magical crap back in his... whatever that place is. We could trade him. You make a fair point. Why aren't you doing that? Icon pop up. Wah, 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 wah. Save icon would pop up where? I've seen it once or twice, but. Like, I don't want to stop and then have to come back and do this all over again. Lever I'm missing or something? There it is. Alright, so you know, we're gonna stop here. When I come back, we'll open this door and whatever else. I'll see you then.